Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you this hair tutorial on how to do bouncy, big banana curl, wavy hair. So keep watching if you like it. For this look, you're going to use a basic brush to comb out all the knots in the extensions. Once you're finished, use a brush with more bristles to get out the smaller knots. For this, I'm going to use Chi Iron Guard to help protect the hair. This will help protect it from split ends and burning the extensions. Then, comb through the extensions one more to spread the iron guard. For our curl, I separate the extensions in the part. This will make it so that it's able if to you want create thick more curls, curls. You're going to have to use a fat curling end just like this. If your curling iron is hot, then you can begin curling. Gently release the extensions from the curling iron. That will be sure to make your hair extensions perfectly curly. After you're done curling, make sure you spray each hair extension with hairspray. I like to use Tresemme. To keep the curls full and volumized, lay them down in this method. Repeat the same routine with all of your hair extensions. Hey guys, so I just backcombed the roots of my hair and clipped in my extensions real quick. So this is what it looks like, and as you can see, it's very curly and volumey. Um, and you can just leave it this way if you like. Depends on how much curls you want, but I'm going to tone it down a bit today and make it a bit natural. So you're just going to brush your fingers through it just like this. And this creates a more natural looking look. And you can also brush through with just a comb, but I would recommend using your fingers more because it's not as harsh as a comb would be. And there you go. Volumey, curly hair. And depending on the length of your real hair, I would curl it, but since mine is so short, it just looks like the curls start at where my hair ends. So usually I don't curl it, but sometimes I do, depending on how high I want my curls. But the, we're doing more of a natural curl, so the curls should be lower. And once you're done, you might want to hairspray your roots just a little bit. And you don't need to do the extensions because you did them when you were curl after you curled them but you can anyway just to make sure that the curls hold the entire day I hope you guys like my tutorial if you have any more hair tutorials you'd like to see or any other tutorial just comment or inbox me so I hope you liked it